fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 men in a fight at Luzi Hollow. Howdy again, viewers. Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, doing some more Red Dead Redemption 2 videos. I'm kind of covering stuff I didn't when I first played the game because at the time I was just trying to deal with the game and I missed a lot. And like I said, I'm going to try and cover some of it. This is called The Noblest of Men and a Woman, and it introduces you to the legendary gunslingers who I actually covered in previous videos from Black Bell and a few others. Yeah, I'll probably leave links in the description below if you want to view those videos. But this is where you meet the writer who gives you pictures of people to basically track down and eventually you will finish out the mission. So let's get on with the noblest of men and a woman. Be a saloon back in 76. Just a lot of bunk, Plato. It's just a lot of bunk. It's not bunk, Mr. Calloway, sir. It's history. Who's your friend there? Put that in your fucking book, Plato. This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy Calloway. Who? The gunslinger. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 men in a fight at Luzi Hollow. What are you waiting for? How do you mean? Well, I reckon right now, kill him yourself. I don't want to kill him. I want to deify him. He's a god. I'm trying to write his biography. How's that going? I think I prefer the duel. Either I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Well, you're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win. Freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm going to write that down, if I may. Be my guest. <laughs> What's your name? I don't have a name. But you are a gunslinger. Not really. I mean, folks who need shooting, I try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff, it's, well, bunk. But you fought duels. Once upon a time, I may have. And you ain't interested in fame. <sighs> I don't think so. Strange. But you like fortune. I need money, sure. Okay. And forgive me, mister, if I seem a little desperate. I am a little desperate. This book. I've got to make a thing of it, and, well, there's a whole list of gunfighters. Legends, every last one. Emmett Granger, Flacco Hernandez, Billy Midnight, Black Bell. Never heard of them. Maybe you can go and speak to them. Ask them about Calloway. Any of them get uppity, shoot them. I can't believe I just said that, but... You want me to go and find some... Sad, deluded fools like him. Ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get uppity, shoot him. Does sound a lot worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. Half the proceeds of the book, if you help me get it written. I'll see what I can do. Ha! Oh, get photos. Okay. And there are notes on the back of those portraits that should lead you to him. I'll see what I can find out. I imagine we'll be stuck here upon your return. Here are some other flop house. Now, if you read all of the photographs, the backs of them, the locations of the gunslingers will be put on the map. And you can then ride out and find the gunslingers, which helps you explore the map. That is one of the biggest mistakes I made when I played. Red Dead Redemption 2, the first time, I didn't explore the world. I was playing the missions through, and by the time I started exploring the world again, Arthur Morgan had already contracted tuberculosis. So, yeah, I'm playing this a little different, 
And like I said, I'm going to be exploring the world more and hopefully not overlooking a lot of things and be able to bring you more wonderful videos. If you found this video likable, well, hit the thumbs up icon. If you like this type of video, hit the subscribe button and bell icon because I post four videos a week involving video games, a short on Wednesday, and an occasional surprise video. You don't want to miss out. As always, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and thanks for stopping by.